Please help me welcome Spider-Man Mulholland to the podium. Thank you. The story was told one time of a boy when he was four years old, they took his mother away from him. When he was 12 years old, they committed his dad insane. This boy went through 12 foster homes, 14 receiving homes, the youth center, and at 15 years old, they institutionalized and put him in a straitjacket. After a year in a correctional facility, they gave up on him, emancipated him through the courts as a legal guardian, and sent him to Skid Row where he spent the next two years. Sleeping in a garbage can. He was abused, beat, shot, stabbed twice in Chinatown and had a very difficult life. One day a ballroom bouncer named Joe Schneumitzner found him in a garbage can, got him enlisted to the United States Marine Corps where he became one of the top snipers in the world, became sniper team number two under Jimmy Carter. This Marine ended up getting hit by an 18 wheeler summer truck and almost killed him. He became a born-again Christian, walked in an apostolic, one God, Pentecostal church, received the Holy Ghost speaking in tongues, and was baptized in Jesus' name. He got out of the United States Marine Corps and went on to build multi-million dollar companies all over America, and is now the chairman of the Building Envelope Science Institute worldwide, and works for Marriott, Starwood, and many of the Fortune 100 companies today. I know that story to be especially true, because you see, I was that young boy. And uh, and I'm very humbled to see how God, I think, has a sense of humor when he would take somebody for a garbage can and then elevate them to a CEO, and so I recently published a book that Warren Buffett endorsed Tony Robbins. Tony Robbins is one of my clients and endorsed my book called Jump, You Have No Excuse. It's a very powerful book. It will challenge you. I brought a few of them today, a limited supply. I'll autograph it for you. You got $10, $15, email them a check. I got some fives for a 20, but I will help you get this book, autograph it. It will challenge you. It'll leave you with no excuse. Let me leave you with this. You cannot kill something that will not die. Someone asked me one time, well, how do you kill something that will not die? I said, you don't. You leave it alone. It'll just frustrate you. Thank you. Thank you.